we made it folks day one first check on the muskrat pond and uh it's been pretty quiet it's early morning and um don't see anybody standing around waiting for me which is always nice and uh we'll see what comes out i'm hoping it'll be quiet i hope i don't have any issues and uh hope we got some muskrats all right here we go well here we go all the fun of trapping in suburbia you see people walking their dogs <sighs> it's always a, a joy <laughs> so i thought we'd trap check the traps real quick and then uh, we'll move some things around a little bit there's my nice beautiful sign still undisturbed and uh it's really kind of weird not to see any muskrats out swimming so far Traps still set. It's kind of strange. I thought this one here for sure would have something in it. Not yet. Looks good. There you do. Alright, keep checking. Gosh, I'd really like to have some more tins down here in the water. Especially along the shelf. All right, let's go. It's a really, really good run right there. And the water right here, as you can tell, is really muddy. So that tells me there's some activity here, uh, which is really what I'm looking for this muddy water right here uh, so I probably ought to get something maybe a cage right in here and I saw that yesterday I didn't set it because I didn't have any more cages but the rest of the water looks really good but that's really kind of what I'm looking for uh, there's no V's see like you have a run like this there's no V's coming and going like you normally see with the muskrats so it kind of tells me that uh, they probably have a, either a real a new muskrat problem or not as established. Looks like we got a rat in here. All right, well let's see what our catch looks like. Lost some of the side. There he is. Not a bad looking muskrat. It's coming out in a cage too, so now we'll probably end up getting all kinds of visitors. <laughs> Want to see the muskrat. There he is. Real nice looking rat. And uh, that should make some people happy. So now that I have my caged muskrat, this is where it gets really interesting because you know people are watching you <laughs> and uh they're gonna want to know what i'm gonna do with that muskrat so this could get interesting you never know what to expect really really good one run right there gotta have a trap right there it's such a nice spot same way with all these runs here all kinds of good looking activity I put a flag there on that one. Making good progress. Looking for a couple colony traps now. Not a bad first check so far. Don't see any more activity. Here's our colony trap it looks pretty good I'm gonna go down and check it out just to double check looking good there I think nothing in it unbelievable hole right there I think what I'll do on him is I'll put him back in the back and I'll just cover him for now 
and then we'll probably relocate him to a river system someplace far far away from here and uh yeah he can live another day so nice nice ending for him Yeah, caught one today. Yeah, making good progress. <laughs> Okay, so day number one, we're on the tube here. We just caught their muskrat right there. Gonna rebate that. I'm uh, surrendering my lunch right now, <laughs> or part of my lunch. I put an apple back there, and I just treated it with my essential oil. Same way with this one here. And we're gonna put this trap here actually inside the tube. I'm gonna wire it out here so the raccoons don't run off of my cage. Um, that's kind of the plan. So let's get that set up. One thing I always like when a water trap is muddying up the trap. Put a nice little layer of mud on the bottom of that. A nice little slide. And we'll cover the top of that with the mud too. All right, folks, we are just wrapping up the tube. Got one in the tube there. And I tied it off with a wire because they're expecting a little bit of water. And you never know with raccoons might run off of my trap and then the other one was nice and well concealed as you can see there uh, nice little cage trap good location of course it produced yesterday and we'll see if it'll produce another day so to catch one muskrat in suburbia um, and to haul it off uh, without having any issues kind of a big deal so pretty excited about that um, we'll continue to check this this pond here for muskrats and these traps will move things around as we need to. Uh, make sure you stay tuned for more episodes just like this one. Um, if you like it, leave me a nice comment down below. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit subscribe. Otherwise, click the thumbs up. I'm Jinx, and have a great day.